Hey YouTube, Diesel Diva coming back to you guys with another video. So today guys, I am in Arizona and I have been at the shipper for about 24 hours. So I am exhausted. I did get a little bit of sleep, but uh, I got there at 10.30 yesterday morning and I'm literally, I just left. So I'm sitting in the line at Blue Beacon getting ready to get a truck wash and trailer wash out and get my tires armor all up and looking nice for my next run. So before I get into this video for today guys make sure that you hit the subscribe button. Make sure you hit the like button. Give me a thumbs up and also hit the bell notification so that you know when I upload another video. So today guys this video is going to be about parking. So, a lot of times when you go to the truck stops and it's at nighttime, um, anytime after like 5, 6 o'clock, it's hard to find a spot. Also at the rest areas and then also even when it is the weekend because you have a lot of drivers that don't have a load over the weekend. So, a lot of times if you get there Friday after a certain time in the evening, you won't find a spot, let alone after midnight. So I wanted to come to you guys and let you know a known little secret. Some of us know, some of us don't. But casino parking is the way to go, guys. I have gone to several different casinos throughout the country. And you always can find a park. They always have truck parking. It's large parking spots, which is great. You don't have to worry about somebody taking your hood off in the middle of the night while you're trying to rest. And as well as they also have lots of trash cans everywhere. It's well lit. And you've got cameras everywhere, so you've got a lot of security going on. So keep that in mind, guys. That's a good tip to keep in mind that if you don't find a spot, you can always go on to Trucker Path, which is a little app that you can download on your phone that will tell you uh, the different rest areas, different truck stops, uh, fuel stations, as well as casinos and shipper and receivers. So make sure that you guys go on Trucker's Path and go ahead and check that out. Also guys, a downfall, oh, I got one more good thing about parking at the casino is you can go in, you can get out of the truck, you can go play a little bit. Also they'll give you a club card which will then give you a CDL discount. So also not only the casinos but a lot of restaurants, a lot of other things, uh, places will give you a CDL discount. So when you get ready to purchase whatever you're getting ready to purchase, just like people go in and say, do you have a senior discount? Always, always ask if there's a CDL discount because a lot of times you'll find that you'll get 10% off of your purchases by showing your CDL uh, license to whatever uh, place that you go to. Now, then you can also go and have dinner, um, play a little bit, have dinner, get out of the truck, you know, and you have, you've got nice parking. You don't have to worry about any of the riffraff because they're going to make sure that security uh, is looking at you at all times and that you're safe. Now, another thing is, is a lot of the casinos have shuttle parking, so sometimes their parking area might be towards the back. Sorry about that. My truck just turned off, but sometimes their parking may be towards the back, but they have a shuttle that'll come and pick you up and take you over to the casino if you decide that that's something that you want to do. Some people might just want to stay in the truck. It's a known fact that truck drivers are gamblers because there is so many different casinos all throughout the country. A lot of us tend to go into the casino um, for parking as well as for pleasure. And um, a lot of customers, I'm sorry, a lot of um, truck drivers have gotten into trouble that way. So just make sure that if you do go into the casino and you go and gamble that you are gambling responsibly because um, just know that casinos are not made upon winners. They are made upon losers. You know, we're the ones paying for the parking structures and the lighting and the security and the food and everything that I just named, that is a good thing. But if you go in there and you spend all your money, just know that they're using that money to pay for um, all the other things that supply the casino. So that's my little tidbit for the day, guys. 
casino parking. If you can't find a spot, go over to the casino. All right, guys. Diesel Diva checking out. And you guys make sure that you stay safe. Stay between the white lines. Be blessed at all times, guys. Be blessed at all times, guys. All right. Have a wonderful day. Bye.